Well, hello there, Charlie Rocks. Welcome back to Rimworld. Uh, got my amazing base at the moment. We've got an outside area. I have got a, uh, <laughs> a shared bedroom for everyone. We've got our nutrient paste thing over here on getting built. I have got a load of stuff to do. So let's try and get the nutrient paste thing built this episode, which is there. I need three of that. I have enough of that. We need a little hopper. I can't remember if you can traverse the land if you build them here or not. We're just going to stick one there for now. And where's the dining? I've got a terrible little dining room here. Look at, look at this. <laughs> it's a space for three people. I mean, that's all we need at the moment. Right, interacting with traders. So we can talk to them with a question mark over the head. Select a colonist and click on the character. Now, I think the important thing to remember with that is you need someone with a high social skill. So if we look on Warden, best person for that is going to be Lisa. Now, Lisa is currently asleep, so I do not really want to wake you up because you will get upset and cry. So I'm going to leave it until as late as possible. Now, one thing you can do, I've not tried for a while, is you can actually antagonize the traders into attacking things. Now, we've not really got any beasties on this level, so we should be okay, but... It's just something to bear in mind. It would be handy in future to do that. Now, I was thinking about defences and that. I've not got a clue how I'm going to defend this base. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to stick a dumping zone outside here, which will give me a bit of cover. And I'm going to put a few sandbags. I have no cloth. Of course, I have no cloth. I've only got a thing. I've got a thing of rice coming out there. I've got potatoes there. Let's get another grow zone. I'm going to need loads of rice. Let's do that as all rice. I don't think there's any point in doing anything fancy for what we're going to be doing. Okay, you are busy working. And I've got a mad rat. Hopefully the traders are going to deal with that. They should do. It'll attack any human pawns, so... Let's see if it comes down here. And let's see what. Let's see how they react to a mad rat. Oh, shooting your own people. It's not really what I'd recommend. Right, is Lisa ever going to get out of bed? Nearly. She's nearly ready. Come on. You've normally got a few seconds when they when they go to leave before you can uh, trade with them. So that's like for you. We'll trade with these now. Let's trade with them now. I'm not actually sure what I've actually got to trade. So on the left is mine, right is theirs. I have seven meals, I have some berries, some components, I have steel, I have a book. I do not want to sell the book. Books are good. Do they have any books for sale? No. They've got a royal bed for sale, which is interesting, because I thought royal was some royal DLC which I've supposedly not got enabled. Um, sometimes it's good to trade with them just to get a bit of uh, rapport with them. Let's get... Oh, I've got one beer. I can't just get one beer. Um, what can I get off you? Should I get some chocolate? Yeah, I'll get a little bit of chocolate. That'll do. A little bit of trade with them. There you go. Right, now I have tasks to do. So, I've got to finish building that. And the moment my constructor is slayed, but Slade is busy doing growing, I think. So, I'm planting that new field. Uh, Lisa is hauling. I want to get away with storing all the steel and stuff outside, though. So, I'm going to put a separate stockpile outside. We did have this one. Which I got rid of. Um, should I do? Would it be worth doing outside shelves? For storing things like... Um, I mean, I was doing it there. Let's go and get some more wood. So, quick way of harvesting it. You can't do 
order and choose harvest but without mods you can't say only harvest fully grown plants so say for instance like this one that's 71 percent grown and if you don't want to harvest it if you do like harvest like this oh that's new is that 1.5 new wait a minute though oh no no, no. chop trees yeah, so that says that's ready, even though that's not 100%. I only want to harvest 100% ones, so I will cancel any by pressing C. And all the others are for game. Okay. You keep mining. What are you doing? Relaxing socially. Bit of herbal medicine collecting. I've got 15 meals at the moment. This is all under packaged, packaged now. That should last for a while. All under the roof, which is good. Right, so we've got rare frumbos. Now, these are good. Frumbos, if you can ever capture one, they make a really good sort of pet to defend against stuff. But they are pretty wild. They do shoot something horrible. So, what I'm going to do, what any normal person would do, I'm going to come over here with my gun <laughs> and then I'm going to get ready with my gun but if you hover over it you can see the range so what I'm going to do is I'm going to come up here like sneaky sneaky shells and I'm going to wait over here with my gun and then I'm going to do this okay let's move up a little bit so I've got a better angle right we're going to fire at that okay now that has now maddened it so what I need to do now is I need to run into my base. I need to try and <laughs> we need to try and fix this wall, and we need to get inside away from the madness that is about to come. So here we go, go 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 go. That is gonna turn into to a trait of manhunter now, and it's gonna try and come for me. So I need to get inside. So Amelia is taking the woods there. Um, okay, I need to get behind a door. Let's get over here. Let's get in here. And Amelia, you come in here as well. Because it's coming. It's a coming. Okay, here we go. I'm sorry, traders. Okay. Now, 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 can you see why I'm doing this? Oh, no. <laughs> the relations have fallen because... Oh, no, 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 no. This, this, this could go horribly wrong for me. Okay. They now do not like me. Um, Could I try and capture these? I don't think I can, you know. Uh, I can class it as hunting. Yeah. Oh, wait a minute. Yeah, we can't. We need level 10 to do that. So let's just hunt them both. Right, let's take you off that. You off that. Uh, Lisa off that. Hopefully someone's going to hunt these. Now, they have got a machine pistol for me. But they now do not like me anymore. Oh, I need a butcher. I need a butcher table to butcher the uh, Frumbo corpse as well. So we are going to have to quickly try and build one. I'm just going to... I know I know it's outside. I just want to get this stuff done. Right. Uh, is anyone hunting? No. I want, I want to hunt these. Uh, hauling... No, 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 no. I need to make sure. When we've got dumping piles like here... We put corpses, no. Yeah, you don't want to be... They are already don't like me. Oh, interesting. Where are you taking that to? This bit, probably. Let's turn it off for that bit as well. Draft you and undraft you. Now, can anyone hunt? Why can no one hunt? Right, Lisa should be my hunter. Right, we'll, we'll hunt it, because while it's incapacitated, we can take it out. And I want to hunt that as well. 
Perfect. We'll deliver wood to that. So that's sort of worked, and then went completely wrong because uh, now now this uh, this nation hates hates me. So the uh, Quafium Treaty. So if we go to World, we'll probably see these local to me. Um, where actually are they? Blue Hill. I think it was Quafium. There is a way of seeing the alliances. Which one is it? This one? So Quafium Treaty is now minus 10 to us. Yeah. Only hostile if it's minus 75. Still, it's not very good what we've just done, though. I am not super proud of that. I mean, there is bodies and stuff. What I could do is... They're not going to take the bodies with them, so I'm going to have to build me some uh, graves. Let's get some graves built over there. Uh, Lisa, you can get on with building those. Amelia should be taking the materials to that. Okay, have we got enough materials? Okay, Lisa's building graves. There you go, burying. See, the thing is with these, I could strip these off, but the trouble is the bodies, I think they're still going to have a trait on them of... Let's see. The items will have a trait on them of um, like deceased or something, I think it is. So I can take that, but if we look at the stuff here, look, it's got a T on it. Which is, if you go to information, I think it was in here. Um, I'm pretty sure that used to be like a deceased trait. So I don't think I really want to do that. We did lose two of them though. Well, Lisa's doing that. I'll strip that one. They're leaving now. Uh, Amelia has done that. Right, okay. Can we, can we build that? Let's, let's, let's concentrate on building this. Because I want to, the reason I want to um, butcher these is because I think they have something called Frumbo Horn, which I think that's worth decentish money. Right, so if we go into here, add a bill, add bill, butcher creature, and we'll just do that forever. Uh, you'll haul in. Let us. Who's actually doing cooking? Amelia's digging. Okay, it's going to have to be Slayed. Interesting. Slade tried to flirt with Lisa by implying good things about his own origin. Lisa was attracted and is now Slade's lover. Slade and Lisa now want to sleep together. Consider assigning them a double bed. Wait a minute. S oh, so Slade's already married someone called Jen and he's now having an affair. So I now need to make them a bed. Oh dear. So I'm going to have to build them a bedroom. I would like to actually do the frumbos next. There we go. Right, let's see if we get the horn off this. Right, Emil. Uh, we have got another thing down here. Now, beds. So I need to do... I'm going to try and do a slightly bigger room. So let's do an extra one and all of that and get you mining this. Okay. So this is the thing I was thinking about. Frumbo horn. I'm pretty sure that's worth, yeah, look, $800 for that. And we've got all this meat as well. Yeah, we need, we need to build that. I have got a lot of meat there, which I don't really have much use for at the moment. Right, uh, you go need a meal. A uh, meal, if you could deliver the wood to that. There's a chair that needs finishing as well. Can you finish that maybe? Perfect. Okay, and then back to your sewing. I do need to finish off building graves as well. Because we don't want bodies all round lot, do we? 
there was at least two bodies. Okay, Lisa, do you want to uh, get rid of the bodies? Let's uh, strip this one. Bury that body. And bury that body. Because we do not want bodies all around the base. Every time they see a corpse, they get upset. So, we'll bury both of these. Remember the great trading disaster. Okay, they're all sleeping in the same room now, which is not ideal, but I do need to get a bigger bed in here. So we're going to do a double bed, wood, and let's try and make the rooms a bit nicer. So if you go down here to beauty, you can see how terrible it is. The more negative, the worse it is. So yeah, <laughs> it's not looking pretty good. Look, look at all the blood and that is. Minus, apparently minus 44 for blood on uh, rice. So we'll turn that off. So I'm going to do some basics for the rooms. I'm going to put a torch in each room. I'm going to put a bed in each room. Now I was looking at these today. The, the end dresser is, it makes the room a little bit more comfortable. It must be placed directly to the head of the bed. I'm going to put one there and then put a chair next to it because I remember you used to be able to like eat in the room. I want to see if these can eat in the room. Now, have I not put a horseshoe pin down yet? I don't think I have. We'll put that down for a bit of recreation. Okay, and then I need to do Slade. That need, room needs to be Slade and Jen's room. No, no, sorry. Slade and Lisa's room. And we need to try and get that finished as well. I'm going to... I'm going to separate these rooms out a little bit. Um, I wonder if to take that down and make it into just a big old... a big old room. And then I can expand this later on. Let's do deconstruct on that bit. And... mine on that bit. Now, we have to be careful we don't mine too much because I always forget about this. People always know this by heart. I always forget... If you've got like a roof, um, if you dig too much, the roof will collapse. Um, which one is it? There is a way of seeing your roof. I think it is this bit. So you can see we've got a nice little roof here. That's a natural roof, overhead mountain. So I'm just digging out what I can. Okay, you're finishing doing the rooms, which is good. Mining all of that uh, steel. I do have a lot of steel. Uh, these need to be finished as well. I feel like, feel like we need someone else to help with construction. I don't want to get... Hmm, Lisa's not very good. Lisa's a medic. Slade's pretty good, but you're also our main gardener, so... It's so hard when you're limited at the start with having people do stuff because there's so much to do. I want to expand this as well. So we'll expand this to... Actually, no, 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 no. We'll put shelves in here. I think... Do we need to expand it as well? I can just... I can hear the sounds of the cat eating the raw meat. It's absolutely disgusting. That's going to be another shelf, anyway. Lisa got smoke leaf. I don't know where we got that from. We can do policies for drugs, actually. Um, so I can just change it to say no drugs, because smoke leaf, although is good at relaxing the characters, I think you do end up getting a dependency on it. Increases appetite, reduces focus, and slows movement. Yeah, they can become dependent on it. Oh, I'm trying to remember how to do it. I've put them on a, on a policy then of... Sorry, I went through that too quick. Um, yeah, if you go into a sign there, and then my drug policy, so I can say no drugs. And I think... I think if you get a campfire, you can actually do a thing where you can be like, yeah, if you, get, if you have any drugs, burn it. I do need to start making some meals. 
see the things I've got. I've got this meat. Now, that will deteriorate and get completely rotten. So, I do need to try and get that built. Oh, there's so much to do. Meat will go off unless it's refrigerated, and I, I do not have the technology to refrigerate stuff. So, it's a bit... The meat's a little bit wasted at the moment, to be honest. Okay, Lisa's hauling all that, which is good. Hauling all the clothes. We've got some nice uh, from booth, from from both air off that. That is also worth a little a little bit of money. Okay, we're getting the stuff hauled. This is a trouble. You've only got one haul. I mean, when? Well, look at this. Haven't I got a policy that says no to that? So why are you smoking that? Oh, there we go. I need to do that. Yeah. I don't think so. You're not enjoying yourself for that. Does it give you a, uh, a boost? Mm, not at the moment. Okay, Slade's going to try and finish building some of this. And it's been butchered. So we have to collect more wood again. Try again. Okay, now what what was that book anyway? Was it construction? Yeah, construction. It is a useful thing for you to be learning, but And I'm gonna do a rock wall a wooden wall here, just until we get the rest of it built. Right. So, looks like we're going to be here for a while. Lisa thinks you should give your faction a name. What should your faction be called? Let's have a look at a few random names. What do I like? I want a single word. Um, show, show you, Father? I'll never remember that. Herna. Yeah, it sounds like Hernia. I mean, the settlement should have a name. Holland, Delto, Stonkley, Golness, Stonebrad. I want Happiness Cliff. Yes. That will do. So we have got Smoke Leaf there, which, interestingly enough, is not going to go rotten now because it's stored on the shelf. Uh, are you hauling anything else? Packaged meals? How many packaged meals have we got left out here? two not a huge amount should have finished the mining now so hopefully we're going to get more people helping with construction oh we still haven't finished the mining it's still ongoing right let's hopefully get this bed done cool right so we need to do a bed now for slade and lisa so slade and lisa are going to share this bed so if we assign this to these two and at the moment if you go and click on them and click on the needs it'll probably say so opinion my lover yes sleeping alone boo so they will be happier once they've slept together in that bed okay i'm gonna let these finish building this out now okay and that bed uh, is gonna be i mean i've got i've got enough for two separate rooms now look I actually have got two separate rooms. One of these could be for a prisoner, maybe. And I think Amelia has finally, finally finished mining now. So we're going to start building more of these shelves outside now. Which is good. Steel's getting hauled. I feel like we're getting all these... Sh these, these uh, st I know it sounds stupid. Can I put a shelf? Like... So we could do like a stockpile of these and do like an area of them. So I could do like that and do reinstall and do it in an area. But I'll be for another video because that is all I'm going to show you for today. We've accomplished a few bit. I killed some from bows. I, accept, I, I uh, upset a whole trading colony. And uh, yeah, we've named our base. So let me know what you think of this so far. This is progressing but not that fast. I thought I'd have nutrient paste done by now, but maybe next episode. Anyway, that is it for now. This is Rimworld 1.5 and I'm Shirley Rocks. See you next time.